Mystery Monsters of the Deep by Gardner Soul is a captivating piece of science writing that delves into the enigmatic world of deep sea creatures. Published in 1957, Soul's essay explores the fascination and intrigue surrounding these elusive denizens of the abyss. Through vivid descriptions, compelling anecdotes, and a well structured narrative, Soul not only introduces readers to the mysteries of the deep but also underscores the importance of scientific exploration and curiosity. One of the essay's striking features is its ability to evoke a sense of wonder and curiosity about the unknown. Soul masterfully opens his piece with an enticing description of the deep sea as a mysterious region that probably holds more secrets than the moon or any other part of the universe. This immediately captures the reader's attention and sets the tone for an exploration into the world beneath the waves. The author's choice of words such as mysterious and secrets conveys a sense of intrigue, inviting readers to join him on this journey of discovery. Throughout the essay, Soul employs vivid and evocative language to paint pictures of the strange and otherworldly creatures that inhabit the depths. He describes the humpback devilfish, a giant squid, as having great saucer-shaped eyes that seem to burn with a hellish fire. This personification of the squid's eyes as burning adds a sense of malevolence to the creature, heightening the drama and mystique surrounding it. Soul's descriptions serve not only to inform but also to engage the reader's imagination, making the deep sea monsters come to life on the page. Soul's essay is not merely a catalogue of bizarre creatures but also an exploration of the human fascination with the unknown. He delves into the history of deep-sea exploration, recounting the tales of early pioneers who ventured into the abyss in primitive diving suits. This historical context provides a sense of continuity and evolution in our quest to understand the deep sea. Soul also introduces the concept of the sea serpent, a mythical creature that has captured the human imagination for centuries. By including this element of folklore, he underscores the timeless allure of the deep sea and its ability to inspire wonder and speculation. Furthermore, Soul emphasizes the importance of scientific exploration and the role of technology in unlocking the secrets of the deep. He discusses the development of underwater cameras and submersibles, highlighting how these innovations have revolutionized our ability to study and document deep-sea life. In doing so, he underscores the idea that the mysteries of the deep are not insurmountable but are within our reach through scientific inquiry and technological advancement. One of the essay's strengths is its structure, which leads the reader on a journey of discovery. Soul begins by piquing the reader's interest with the allure of the unknown, then proceeds to introduce various deep-sea creatures and their characteristics. He also includes anecdotes and real-life accounts of encounters with these creatures, which serve to humanize the scientific exploration process. These anecdotes not only provide a sense of immediacy but also highlight the dedication and courage of scientists and explorers who venture into the deep. In conclusion, Mystery Monsters of the Deep by Gardner Soul is a compelling and evocative exploration of the enigmatic world of deep-sea creatures. Through vivid descriptions, historical context, and a narrative structure that leads the reader on a journey of discovery, Soul captures the intrigue and wonder associated with the mysteries of the deep. His essay serves as a reminder of the boundless possibilities of scientific exploration and the enduring human fascination with the unknown depths of the ocean.